Hi, this is Jim, WA2UJ, and I'm going to give you a quick walkthrough of my IQ64 station. Over here, we have a USB mic, the transceiver itself, the IQ64, a keyboard, and a mouse. Let's uh, zoom in a little bit on the uh, IQ64. It's got a uh, high-resolution touchscreen, and it's running right now, it's running uh, Quisk operating software. Of course the radio is built in and it makes about 5 watts. I turn up the volume. Number 4 CQJ, good afternoon, you're 5 9, over. And uh, listen to uh, 9 Alpha 9 Alpha working a pilot. Roger 73, thank you. 9 Alpha 9 America. I was, uh, I talked to him earlier, got a 5 and 9. I don't, think I, can, Sierra, 59. I don't think I can talk and operate the radio at the same time. One of the unique things you can do with this radio is it's about the only radio that you can also look them up on QRZ.com right on the radio screen. Um, it's a lot of fun to use. That's an example of voice contacts. Um, <clears throat> it's it's uh, very easy to tune. Uh, let me, I'll, maybe I'll zip down to 40 meters and see what's going on there. Of course, it's dead. Um, there's the station. Just click, tune them right in. Uh, see your track. That's quite the run. Uh, it's almost, uh, it's almost, <laughs> uh, a duplicate here. Not quite as, not quite as long. Quite an interesting, uh, operating conditions. Also, there it is, echoed on my Windows PC via VNC. So that means I could be operating this radio from just about anywhere. Thanks for watching.